Hey, do you see that tree? The huge one on the right side. Yep. In summer season, it was absolutely green. But now, in autumn season, it appears to be a different tree. How did it change color? <laughs> it did not change color. Now, most of its leaves have changed color. But why do leaves change color in autumn, Professor? As you already know, plants make their own food. They take water from the ground through their roots. They take a gas called carbon dioxide from the air. They turn water and carbon dioxide into food and oxygen. Oxygen is a gas in the air that we need to breathe. Plants make their food using sunlight and something called chlorophyll. Chlorophyll gives leaves their green color. Winter days are short and dry. Many plants stop making food in the fall or autumn, so the chlorophyll goes away. Then we can see orange and yellow colors. These colors were in the leaves all summer, but the green covered them up. But then, why are some leaves red? Red is made in the fall or autumn from food trapped in the leaves. Even brown is also made in the fall. And the color brown comes from waste left in the leaves. Absolutely right. What are you munching on? A carrot. A vegetable? Are carrots vegetables? Not sure. Ask Professor. Yep. A carrot is a taproot that grows underground. Therefore, it is usually considered a vegetable. According to most definitions, a vegetable is usually any edible plant part other than a sweet fruit or seed. Ugh, the definitions are so confusing. Let's put it simply, one by one. Okay? Okay. A carrot is a root vegetable. It has tapered edges. It can be colored orange, yellow, purple, red or white. The root or tuber part of the carrot is eaten. Many people like to eat carrots, both adults and children. Yes. Now, do you follow? What? that we should eat more carrots because vegetables are very good for health. Come on, try it. Oh no, watching you eat it is making my mouth water like I've tasted something extremely sour. But aren't all fruits supposed to be sweet? More or less, I guess. Then why aren't lemons? Professor, why are lemons sour? Well, lemons are fruits with high citric acid content. Lemon juice has about 5% to 6% citric acid. The acid gives lemons their sour taste. In fact, this makes lemon juice an inexpensive, easily available acid at home. 
That's why lemons are widely used in educational science experiments all over the world, besides being used in cooking and baking. Whoa! Now I know why it's sour! This shirt is so stiff. Did your mom starch it by any chance? I, I have no idea. Didn't you know that starching a shirt makes it stiff? Um. <laughs> you didn't know, obviously. Starch is given to a fabric or clothing to give it a wrinkle-free, stiffened, perfect look. So, a starched shirt always looks fresh and pressed well. You look nice wearing a starched shirt. But wearing a starched shirt is so uncomfortable. Oh no! Actually, your shirt seems to be over-starched. <laughs> uh-huh. Yep. Just ask mom not to overdo it next time. Sure, professor. I'll do that. Dog, you are next. Let's first check your height and weight. 